Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel and in this video we will discuss about energy and its types. First of all, uh, we need to define about energy. Energy uh, is defined as the ability uh, of a body to do work is known as energy and its two types. One is known as kinetic energy and other is potential energy. First of all, we need to define about what is kinetic energy and what is its formula and what is the dimension of kinetic energy as well. And in addition, we will also discuss about potential energy and its units and dimension as well. First of all, the definition of kinetic energy is that kinetic energy is equal to ability of a body to do work due to its motion 1 over 2 half mv scale it means that the ability of a body to do work due to its motion because it depends upon only on velocity so uh, in addition uh, for potential energy it is defined as uh, the ability of a body to do work due to its position uh, its position means m g and h this position is defined by height and uh, we can also say that when a body has some height or it is going on some height it is gaining the potential energy at maximum height the potential energy will be maximum potential energy is directly proportional to h height and kinetic energy is directly proportional to velocity if body is going uh, or getting higher velocity the kinetic energy is going to be increased and uh, if height is increasing then potential energy is also increasing furthermore we can also discuss about their units first of all we need to uh, extract the units from their formulas the formula of kinetic energy is half m v scale so this term half 1 over 2 is a constant quantity we will not uh, include in the units though so the meter uh, kilogram meter uh, 1 1 by 2 m v scale it means that this is mass of the body kilogram this is velocity the unit of velocity is meter per second and its scale so if we open this it will become kilogram meter square and per second square so this is also a unit uh, it, it can also be uh, asked in your inter test exam or board exam but if we want to convert this unit into SI units we need to separate this meter so it will be kilogram meter per second square and into meter because these are m raised to power 2 so we will uh, extract this and write in separate form because in order to make or in order to convert into SI units uh, you know that this is a Newton and this is meter and if we this is also a unit of energy and if we convert or uh, make in SI unit it is Joule so SI unit of kinetic energy is Joule Newton meter and kilogram meter square per second square. This is a unit of kinetic energy. If we want to calculate the dimension, the dimension will be kilogram meter square per second square. So the dimension will be the dimension of kilogram is extracted from mass m capital length meter l scale t minus 2 so this is the unit of kinetic energy and uh, we, we know that the energy all energies are same and their units must be same in order to prove this the unit of kinetic energy and the unit of potential energy must be same so we know that potential energy is equal to m g and h so the unit of uh, m is kilogram mass kilogram and g is gravitational or acceleration so meter per second square and height is in meters so if we convert this it will become kilogram meter square 
per second square and it is same as the unit of energy of kinetic energy so uh, if we combine this or uh, this is known as Newton kilogram meter per second square Newton and this is meter and it will become Joule so the unit of potential energy and kinetic energy is same and it is proved in addition we can say that when body has max is on maximum height the potential energy is maximum uh, we can solve one case in this case we can say that uh, at the, uh, this is earth surface of earth if a body is on the surface of earth so the kinetic energy can be maximum but potential energy is equal to zero because height is equal to zero in this case but body is has, um, has is in certain height has gained some height so it will be uh, potential at some height at this point we can say that potential energy may be maximum but kinetic energy is equal to zero because at this point the body is, body is not moving so the velocity of the body will be zero up till now we have finished about the uh, definition of energy in addition uh, kinetic energy potential energy and their units and we have discussed one case in which case kinetic energy is maximum or at what point kinetic energy is minimum or potential energy is maximum up till now we have finished and uh, we will see you in the next lecture if you like our video you can subscribe our channel and if you want to contact uh, my contact information is also given in the video see you bye bye